Hey guys, welcome to Plank 10. 10 minutes, 10 planks. 50 seconds of work, 10 seconds to transition to your next move. So, we're going to be working a lot of shoulders and core today. So let's get started with our proper plank form. And bring your hands under your shoulders. Walk those feet back. Now, intermediate advanced, you're here. Intermediate and beginner, okay? Please remember to take your options as needed once you be able to complete the workout. Here we go with our first one. So we're in plank. We're going to drop the knees, lift the knees, lift left, lift right. Again, knees down, knees up, lift left, lift right. Down and up, left and right. Now, think about keeping those hips down. Keeping your navel pulled into your spine the whole time we're in this workout because those are the areas that really matter. Okay? We want to make sure we're keeping our hips stable, really tightening that core. We're going to get a lot of work done today, guys. In just a 10 minute period, you will feel this everywhere and probably tomorrow and the next day too. <laughs> 50 seconds will feel like an eternity to us. But we'll get through it together. Okay, next up, we've got low plank with a crawl. So we're going to bring the elbows down. Elbows stay directly under the shoulders. Walking the feet back in line with the hips. And we're going to take the left knee toward the left elbow. Right knee toward the right elbow. Intermediate, you're here. And beginners, knees under hips, you're here. Now you think about taking that knee around, almost in like a C motion, squeezing that hip and oblique. Shoulders, core. Again, knees down if you need to. You've got to make it through 10 intervals. We got this team. Saved by the buzzer. All right, next up, side planks. We're gonna come over to your right side, or whichever side you wanna start on. Okay, bending that bottom knee, you're gonna come up to a modified side plank, and we're gonna bring that elbow toward the knee and crunch that oblique. Now, if you're happy and you know it, you can stay here. If you need a lowered, more beginner level option, you can lower that hip. But we wanna keep extending and contracting the side of your body. So whichever level you choose, you will be working. <laughs> Now, if you want to really challenge yourself for the last few seconds, come all the way up and again, those are all your levels. I want you to be able to complete the whole workout. Beautiful. We're going to do the same move on the other side. So let's gracefully take ourselves around to the other side Again, bending that bottom knee. Let's pick up. We're going to pull that elbow in toward the knee, contracting your side of your body, breathing in, exhale as you crunch, squeezing that oblique, we really want to focus on isolating all of our core muscles today while we're doing this plank workout. So good for your body, we are getting so much done in this little bit of time. Woo! Super intense. And don't forget, you can bring that hip down if you need to for the last couple of moves. All right. So we are moving right along. We're going to go to a plank walkout. So walking out, walking in. We're going to bring those hands directly under the shoulders. And again, your option, walk it left, right, left, right. Hands walk out, hands come back. 
Hands walk out, hands come back. So we're moving that hand forward, kind of throwing off your balance a little bit. And it distributes the weight a little differently to make it a little more challenging for your core. You'll feel those muscles in the lower core tighten up as you bring those hands away from you. Keep those hips steady. The head in line with the spine, just glancing out over the top of your mat. And beautiful. Take a little cat stretch, curl the hips under, and moving right along to our triangle plank. So for this one, guys, we're gonna start out on our elbows. And I'm in beginner level right now. Hands are in a triangle, and we're gonna press up and down from the mat. So, beginners, you're gonna stay there, intermediate, advanced. We're gonna slide our knees back and you want to make sure that you're pushing off the palms. Now if you need another level you can take it to a walk down down up up and if you really want to challenge yourself coming all the way up to your toes okay in that walk whoo that's a hard one Sitting back in your child's pose with thumbs up. Get that tension out of the triceps for a second before we go into our next one, which is going to be jump in and out with a climb. So back to high plank. We're gonna jump those feet in, out, and then climb left, climb right. Again, jump in and out, knee in, knee in, in, and out. Now you want to make sure, of course, you're keeping those hips down close to the mat. And your option here is either bring the knees down and continue with that climb move, or you can come up to a full high plank, walk it in, and walk it out. You're here, okay, or you're here. Perfect, sit back and breathe. We are moving right along. We're gonna go into a low plank. So back here, and we're gonna bring ourselves out. Hips are down, and lifting the hips up, lower the hips down. Now imagine that someone has a string tied through your belly button, <laughs> through your spine, and they're lifting you up by your hips, and as you're lifting, you wanna draw the lower core in, and press up onto your toes, point the toes, flex the feet as you come up. Woo. Low plank hip lift, almost bringing the body into like a low V. All right, guys, we have two more moves to do before we can call it a day. So tricep push-up, side plank, one of my favorite moves. Hands come back under the shoulders. And this time, we're gonna come up, elbows in, turn to side plank. And elbows in, open to side plank. Now, you know that a tricep push-up you keep your elbows in, but it's also harder than a regular push-up. So if you need to modify, please do so, so that you can make it all the way through. We have one more move <laughs> after this, and then we are finished with the workout. Please don't leave me yet. I get lonely. <laughs> Stay with me, gang. So what I'm doing is kind of a half modify, a tricep push up I take to my knees, then I push up to my toes for the side plank. All right, side plank hip roll. So we're gonna roll from side to side here. We're gonna stack our arms horizontally, forearm to forearm, and you're gonna come up to your left side, drop the hip, lift, roll back to the center. 
Other side, drop, lift, roll through. Got it? It's fun, right? <laughs> I like this one. I think this one's fun. It's a good one to end with. Yeah. Oh, I've had so much fun here with you guys today. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, comments, feedback. I'm awesome at taking feedback and doing what you guys want. So tell me what you want. Tell me what you feel like working out to. <laughs> and I'll try to implement it into my programs. All right, great. Well, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. We're fitting it in. Quick stretch back, hips to heels. Quick downward dog. Heels on the ground, just open up the back of your body. You guys rocked it today. <sighs> if you haven't subscribed, please click the subscribe button. Stay in the know. And again, thank you so much for fitting it in. Love y'all. Take care. Have a great day.